Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about loan assumption pros and cons. In 2022, here at Excite Capital, we did two loan assumption deals and one fresh new debt deal. When you're looking to buy an apartment building or a commercial real estate in general, you have two main options. One, you secure a new debt, where you get a new or a fresh mortgage or a debt on the deal, or two, you assume an existing debt. This is where you, you take on an existing debt with the current terms from the previous owner. Now, let's look at some of the pros. One, time savings. Loan assumption can be approved in less than 30 days in some cases, whereas a new loan may take a longer time because of the extra due diligence and extra documentation that may be required in order for you to assume the debt. Two, to get a new debt, excuse me. Two, money savings. Because of less documentation, usually save a lot of money. Three, the terms. The buyer has the opportunity to receive the better terms when it comes to assuming the debt. For example, you get lower interest rates, longer term, and sometimes in some cases, like the deal we just did today, uh, that we just did uh, at the end of the year, uh, we did it at 4.09%, whereas the market is at 5% or, or more. Another benefit is low down payment. Usually, when you're assuming the debt, uh, based on what where the number is at, you get a lower down payment. And finally, better deals because you have a, a more you have more people competing for these loan assumption deals. Um, you the, you as a seller usually get a better terms. Now let's, let's talk about some of the cons. One is longer approval process. If the current loan is currently overly complicated, usually it takes a lot of documentation, a lot of due diligence. Hence, it takes a longer time for you to get approved for the loan. You're stuck with one lender. That's another problem. In the deal that we just did, we had a horrible, uh, a horrifying experience with the current lender, and because of most of the this kind of debt, the, the 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 current lender knows the previous seller. Sometimes they want to match you with that experience that they have. Sometimes you have higher down payment, um, and based on the loan, the loan that's that's remaining on the deal, there are chances that you might be able to. You have to bring in a higher payment. Now the last one is worse terms. In a lot of deals. Uh, when it comes to uh, loan assumption, if the terms are bad, then you're going to inherit those bad terms. Now, one other big one is um, about loan assumption that you know sometimes it's kind of uh, a, 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 a bad piece is that is the quality of the loan. If the quality of the loan is not good, um, you have a potential of buying a bad or assuming a bad debt. Now, because of these cons, it is important for uh, to have a uh, financial contingency in your um, in your offer, uh, so that if you know for any reason the the loan assumption doesn't go as planned, you can actually back out of the deal. I hope this has been beneficial. Beneficial. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you.